Life Track with Chuck Swindoll is a presentation of Insight for Living Canada. Warren Wiersbe in one of his works writes, History reveals that God's servants are usually misjudged by their families. D.L. Moody was called Crazy Moody by many people in Chicago and even the great apostle Paul was called mad. That's a difficult thing that you will live with and face. Uh, you will do the right thing for the right reason and be judged for either wrong thing or wrong motive. Prepare for it now. It's coming. Some of you even have family members who frown when they think of your being here rather than where they thought you should be in your studies or graduate work. Press on. Go right on. You have nothing to prove when you walk in obedience to Jesus Christ. Go right on. Stay at it. Now, what do you do when you're misunderstood? First, when misunderstanding occurs, ask who. Just consider the source. My dad used to say, when some people speak against you, just consider the source, son. You know, when a mule kicks you, it's because he's a mule. And some people come after you because of their problem, not yours. Ask who. Consider the source. Second, if it continues, ask why. Examine the reason. Could it be you're doing something without realizing it that comes across another way than you thought it would? That's where counselors help. That's where your mate will help you if you're married. That's where a good friend among the board or within the staff will help you. Ask him to assist you in examining the reason that this is continuing to surface. In our church in Fullerton, we decided to buy a pipe organ after we had built the building. Looking back, we should have done it all at one time, you know, taken all the flack at one time rather than spread it out. And um, we decided when we bought the pipe organ, we would do it in a certain way. Except at first, we didn't think that. We learned that later on. Our first feeling is that everybody would want it. And we discovered not everybody did want it. So we worked out a plan that was acceptable where only the gifts given in a certain way would be used for it. And only if we got an X amount would we carry on the plan. It worked beautifully and we got to where everybody loved it. Though we thought at first only the music lovers were going to love it. And... Uh, 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 I got counsel, I got help on that, in, on that uh, situation. I considered the reason behind the flack that was coming and through the assistance of the others around me, we worked out a plan that was really acceptable. When misunderstanding occurs, ask who. If it continues, ask why. As it ends, ask what. What lessons have I learned through this? What has happened to me through this? Have I gotten bitter? Lord Jesus, you have saved me from hell's black abyss. Now save me from the tyranny of bitterness, writes one very wise poet. Have you been misunderstood by someone? Learn from that experience to count on God to protect and defend you during those times. Ask him to fight the battle for you and resist the temptation to avenge yourself. This is Steve Johnson of Insight for Living Canada. Listen to more of Chuck Swindoll's Lifetrack messages at lifetrack.ca. Lifetrack, where life and truth meet. The preceding Life Track presentation was brought to you by Insight for Living Canada. The original message, Being Misunderstood, was copyrighted in 1995 
and this Life Track sound recording was copyrighted in 2014 by Charles R. Swindoll Incorporated. All rights are reserved worldwide.